Thanks for joining bar class today. Let's start by setting our posture, feet under hips, lift up through those legs, lift the rib cage up off the waist, roll the shoulder blades down the back, lift the chin, level the head, back of the head over the back of the spine. Feel the top of the head lifting toward the sky. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, push that air up and out. Inhale up. And exhale, up and out. One more time. Inhale, expand slowly. Exhale. Feel how tight that core is, how engaged. Stay engaged throughout the class. We're going to do one-sided work today. So we'll work on one side and then the other to make sure that we uh, work evenly on both sides and don't let our strong side compensate for the weak. We're going to start in second position and arms out, feet turned out about 45 degrees. We're going to come down into a plie, lifting one heel as we do. Lift that heel, other side. As you alternate lifting those heels, focus on feeling the pelvis moving straight up and down and not subtly shifting toward the side that has the lifted heel. So really focusing on just pushing straight down, push, 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 head and shoulders coming straight out of those hips. Eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, one. Stay down, lift, 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 lift. One heel at a time. Lift, lift, lift for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, rise it up. Coming to a bat ma, so that's a straight leg kick in our uh, turnout, in our hip rotation, zip up those legs, lift up, arms out again for balance. We're gonna do front side, back side, and then switch. So front, side, back, side, switch, front, side, back, side, Switch front, side, back, side, front, side, back, side, two more each, two more sets, side, back, side, front, side, back, side, last set, front, side, back, side, and front, side, back, side, nice. All right, let's finish this with a glissade. We'll start with just a step and then we can turn it into a jump if we'd like. First position, slide that foot out, step, catch your balance, step, catch your balance. So you can turn this into a jump if you'd like or keep it at a step. Either way, trying to get some nice, Lateral distance here. Jump eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and done. Nice. Grabbing your weights. We're going to come into our arm series. We are going to start with single arm flies. So we're gonna have feet parallel, hip distance apart, lift up through those legs, engage the core, hinge at the hips, nice straight aligned spine, head stays in line with the spine, roll the shoulders back, squeeze the shoulder blades together, drop one arm and then the other. Drop, drop, nice. Big squeeze at the top, 
Don't let that chin stray down toward the chest. Down and squeeze. Down and squeeze. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Get ready to pulse, pulse. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Rise up, arms down, shake them out. We're gonna come into parallel feet, lifting up tall. We're gonna do an alternating arm press, not alternating, we're gonna all do one arm. So arms up, elbows open, in line with the body. One arm, arm press in, press up. Lead with that elbow to the center of the body, press up. Other hand is just static. Press up, in, press up. So in, open up all the way. Nice open elbow, elbow and wrist parallel. Up, four, three, two, one. Now the tough part, leave this hand here, other side and up, in and up, in and up, sweeping that elbow in not letting the hand get in front of the elbow, either direction. Lead with the elbow in, press up, in, press up. Keep it going. Four and up, three and up, two and up, Last one, and up together, in, up, in, up, four, three, two, one, and hands down. We're gonna come to the mat to do our tricep pulses. We're gonna be in bird dog. So lay out your mat or other cushion for your knees, coming into hands and knees, weight in one hand, extend the leg um, opposite the hand holding the weight, push up with your belly, make sure that you're not letting your spine collapse, nice engaged core, hips and shoulders square to the mat, lift that palm, up above the glutes if you can, palms facing toward the sky, roll that shoulder back, nice open chest, pulse to the sky. Pulse, pulse, pulse. Pulse, pulse, pulse. Head is in line with the tailbone. Your gaze, you should see your fingertips in the lower part of your peripheral vision. You should not be looking down at your hand and you definitely should not see your belly button. Pulse, 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 eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Other side. Resquare those hips, resquare those shoulders. Extend the leg, extend the arm, roll that shoulder back, open chest, pulse up. Pulse, pulse. Pulse, nice. Pulse, pulse, pulse. Lift eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And stand it back up. Mat back to the side. Coming into a bicep curl, well, bicep curl variation. First position, heels together, open those toes, zip up the inner thighs, lift up that column of the body, 
arms straight out to the side, rib cage isolation, and curl. So trying to lock your hips into place, just moving that rib cage movement coming from the waist. Curl, 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 nice. Keeping those arms nice and parallel to the floor. You guys look awesome. Curl, curl, curl. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Stay here, one arm. In, out, in, out. Other hand. Palm is facing to the sky, holding there. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Leave that arm extended in, in, in. Nice. Shoulders away from the ears. In, in, in. Eight, seven, six, five, Four, three, two, one, arms down. Coming into a, an alternating um, row, feet parallel, hinge from the hips, palms face the thighs, head nice and in line. Coming, squeeze those shoulder blades together. Same thing we did with the flies, drop one arm and then the other down. Down, big squeeze at the top of the lift. Squeeze with both shoulder blades. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Nice. Core engage. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, squeeze together, pulse, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, stand it up, At 90 degree raises, alternating sides, hips stay square, shoulders stay square, no swiveling, Roll those shoulders back. One arm in front, one arm to the side. One arm in front, one arm to the side. Holding on to the core. Nice. You guys look awesome. Great strength and control there. Lift and down. Lift and down. Lift. Lift, lift, lift. Four, shoulder blades stay locked in place. Three, shoulders stay away from the ears. Two, one, switch, switch, switch. Awesome, you guys, totally motionless torsos. I love it. Switch, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Down, shake it out. We're gonna finish with uh, one more tricep. This will be our standing tricep. We're gonna bring those arms overhead, elbows lock in next to those ears. Dropping the weights down behind you. Not letting the elbows flare out. Keep them nice and narrow next to the head. Down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, Three, two, one, pulse those weights. Eight, seven, 
six, five, four, three, two, one. Bring them down, put the waist to the side. Getting a hold of our chair or going to your wall or whatever you're using for support. We are going to start with a paper plate or glider or sock or towel or whatever will glide on your floor. Facing the bar, we're going to be in a rond de jambe. We're going to be doing demi and demi and then grand. So hmm, actually, let's get both of our plates. We'll just alternate sides. Kind of challenge our balance to move side to side. So plates under the feet, feet in first position, facing the bar. Start with that tendu forward, demi. Demi, and now we're going to bend that standing knee coming into a plie for a grand. Switch sides, demi, standing knee, demi, and grand, grand de jambe. Demi, demi, grand, Jean, Demi, Demi, Grand, Grand de Jean. Nice. Demi, Grand, come through. Demi, Demi, Grand, come through. One more set like this. Grand. Bring it through, demi, demi, and bring it through. Plates to the side, our second set, we're gonna do those rond de jambe on there, which means that we're gonna lift our feet up off the floor. So feet off the floor, demi, demi, grand, rond de jambe, demi. Demi, grand, rond de jambe. So really working, it's easier in the air to get um, uncalibrated, letting that hip open to the side. So keeping those hips really square to your chair or bar. Circle, circle, plie, and around. Circle, circle, plie, and around. Really feeling that leg rotate through the hip socket, keeping that nice turnout throughout the movement. Circle, circle, ground, plie, circle, circle, plie and through, circle, circle, plie, and through, last set, circle, circle, plie, and through, circle, circle, plie, and through, coming down to stay in this plie, on layer, circle through, two, Three, four, standing straight up, head to, right up to the sky. Seven, eight, coming down, other side. Eight, seven, six, core engaged. Five, four, nice, you guys. Three, two, one and release, awesome. Coming into a squat, a single leg squat. Feet are parallel, one hand on the bar. You can have this hand on your hip, out for balance or just whatever is comfortable. You can have it in front of you. We're going to start by bringing this toe out in a tendu, but it's staying square in the hip socket. Come down, single leg squat, tendu to the side single leg squat. So focus should be on the position of the standing knee. 
when we have this leg open, the knee kind of wants to come toward the center of the body, keeping the knee strong so that it is not collapsing to the center. Very important. Pushing those glutes behind. Just barely resting the toe of this foot on the floor. We've got this hand here for balance. All the work in the standing glute. Four. Three. Two. One. And pulse, 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 pulse. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Release, come to the other side. Feet parallel, hand resting on bar, tondu to the side, single leg squat. Tondu, push the glutes behind, knee is staying behind those toes, strong knee not collapsing toward the center. In, out, and squat, out, and squat, nice job. Squat, four, three, two, one, and pulse, 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 pulse. Eight, seven, six, five, Four, three, two, one. Stand it up. Coming back to the side. If you have a ball or rolled up towel or a uh, throw pillow that you can use, squish that between your thighs. We are going to, um, Okay, sorry, I'm just like checking my notes here. Got it. Rise up into releve, walk those feet together. Squish, if you don't have the object, that's fine. Legs will be squished together, feet will be squished together. We're going to start just standing here, open arm to the side, to the front, to the side, to the front. Very subtle movement. If you'd like, you can come to a balance here. Destabilizing just a little bit, engaging that core. Four, three, two, one. We're up in releve, so we're working our calves. Bringing this leg up, I mean this arm up. Come down, bring that elbow down toward the hip. Everything stays lifted, so hips are still lifted in the air, working that oblique, working that core, still squeezing the thigh. So still working the inner thigh, still working those calves. Four, three, two, one, face the bar and squat. Squat, 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 four, three, two, one. We're still on our toes if you can. Other side, front and side, front and side. Working on that balance if you'd like, front and side. Squeeze the thighs together to stabilize yourself, four, three, two, one, arm up, squeeze the elbow toward the hip, lifting the rib cage up and over, squeeze, squeeze, eight, seven, 
six, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, come down from those toes. Nice. Hold on to the bar, but let's, or the ball, but let's uh, get a little stretch in those calves. Letting the heels fall to the floor. Lift up the toes if you can to increase the stretch along the back of the legs. Straight knees. Nice. Okay. Standing facing the bar. Ball squeeze behind the knee. We are going to come into a fire hydrant. So uh, bending over the chair, hips are square, lift, lift, lift. So feel the work in the oblique, in the glute, and that standing glute. Lift, 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 four, three, Two, one, push behind you, lift, 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 lift. A little more in the hamstring here. Core is protecting that spine from flexing. We are in this uh, 45 degree angle. It's really easy to let the spine take the movement here. Four, three, two, one side, push back, side, push back, side, push back, side, push back, four, push, three, two, one, and get ready for the other side. Standing glute should definitely be talking to you. It's getting ready to work. Grab that ball, 45 degree angle with the body, knees are lined up, lift to the side in that fire hydrant. Movement is the leg in the hip joint, not the pelvic girdle lifting. Lift, lift, lift. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Push back up, 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 up. Eight, seven, six, five, four. Three, strong core, protect the lower back. One, now side, back, side, back, side, back, side, back, four, three, two, one. And done with that ball. Nice. All right. Last movement for our bar series. You can put your chair to the side and come back to center floor. We're going to be doing some lateral lunges. You know, we're not going to use the plate. We'll step side to side. So feet are parallel. Keeping those feet parallel. Step out. Bend that knee, rise up and down. Other side, out, in and down. Out, in and down. Trying to catch your balance back at the center and down. Out, in and down. Constantly destabilizing that center of your gravity. Really helps you Make sure your core is working to stand you up. Four, in and down. Three, in 
and down. Two, in and down. Last one like this, in and down and pulse. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Other side, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and center. Awesome, coming to the mat for our core series. Lay that out. We are going to start in a side play. Option for hand or elbow, I'm gonna go hand. We're gonna do dips and thread the needles. Uh, lots of options for our feet. We can uh, have both knees bent, bottom knee bent, one foot in front, top foot in front, back foot in, in behind. Stack the feet. If you wanna make it super challenging, I don't know if I'm even up for this today, bring that ball in between the feet to destabilize that top leg, starting with pulse. So dip that hip down, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, thread the needle, up, down, up. Oh, I'm gonna have to let go of the ball for this one. Down, up, down, up, four, three, two, one. Hold it here, four, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and down. Other side. Choose your leg position. Choose your hand position. Starting with those hip dips. Dip, eight, seven, six, five, four, Three, two, one. Thread the needle. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Hold it here. Eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, one, and release. Coming to our back. So if you have a ball, keep it. If not, that's fine. I'll use an imaginary ball. We are going to come from a pencil stretch. So legs extended, arms extended, sit up into a boat pass that ball or that imaginary ball behind, extend back, rise up into a boat, pass the ball, extend back. So lift the head and shoulders and the feet, extend back. Nice control here, really good. Deliberate movements, not collapsing down, not jerking up using your core to press the belly button down, anchor those glutes to the mat, <sighs> rotate that pelvis a little bit under, and extend up, pass, extend two more, up, pass, extend, up, pass, 
extend. Let's finish it up by rising back up into this boat. Pass, 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 pass. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And done, nice job. Coming onto our side, we are going to uh, do some leg lifts. You can rest your head on your arm, extend your arm and use it for a pillow. Nice straight line with the body. Top hand can be on the hip or on the mat for stability. Lift, lift, down, down, up, up, down, down. Top leg, then bottom leg. Top, bottom, bottom. Getting a nice height here with this top leg, if you can. Should be work to lift that bottom leg up to it. Four, three, two, one. Leave that top leg there. Tap, tap, tap. Tap, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Hold here, eight, seven, six. Lifting that head up if you can. Really feel like you're just getting a little bit of support with this arm. Three, two, one. And coming to the other side. Get yourself set up. Choose your head position and the position of your top arm. Up, up, down, down. Up, up, down, down. Up, up, down, down. Up, up, down. Down. Down, up, up. Four, three, two, one. Lift that top leg, tap, 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 tap. Eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, one. Hold it here, lift that head. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Coming down. Push back into a child's pose for a second. We're going to come into a push up variation. You can choose knees or toes. We're going to be doing a passe push up. So that moving leg will be in turnout in the hip socket. If you're on knees, hands are under shoulders, top of the head reaching forward, strong core, uh, fingers slightly angled in, we'll bring that. Leg into passe, touch the toe, lift that knee, hover the knee. Same thing, toes. We're gonna do two sets of eight. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Hold, take a break for five. Four, three, two, one second set. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And sit back again. Roll those wrists. You can rock the hips. Roll the shoulders, nice job. Coming back 
to the floor on our back. Grab those paper plates, gliders. You want both of them. We're gonna be doing hamstring pull-ins. Glutes are all the way at the edge of the mat. Feet are on the plates. Tuck the shoulder blades under to open the chest. Palms face down on the mat. Lift those glutes up. Start with one leg. Lift, glide that other foot out. On the top, really feel that strong lift. Squeeze, squeeze. Squeeze, start putting a little more weight into that gliding foot. Dig that heel in, feel that hamstring engage. The back of the thigh. Dig, out, and dig, out, and dig, out, and dig. Stay here or both feet, drag those heels, glide, and drag, glide, and drag, glide, and drag, four, three, two, one, and pulse, pulse, pulse those hips, eight, seven, six, five, Four, three, two, one. Roll it down. Let's finish our core series with some classic crunches. If you still have your weights handy and you'd like to grab them, you can take one in each hand, cross your arms over your chest, lift your face to the sky, lift, lift, lift. Lift, belly button pushes down. That strong downward movement is what starts the head and shoulders lifting. Let's start to walk those feet. Walk, walk, walk. Face is still trying to reach up to the sky. Walk, walk, walk. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Weights to the side. Extend the arms, extend the legs. Nice pencil stretch. Rolling onto one side, using your arm as a pillow, grab hold of that uh, below the knee, the shin, the calf or the foot. Line up those hips, nice and stacked. Top hip should almost feel like it's leaning forward a little. If this isn't quite enough stretch, you can open that knee toward the back of the body just a little, as long as it doesn't put pressure on your lower back. That will increase your stretch in the hip flexor. Rolling over onto the other side. Grab onto whatever part of your leg works. Hips stacked. Top hip almost feeling like it's falling forward. Move that top knee back an inch or two if that gives you a better stretch without losing your alignment. All right, coming to hands and knees. Step those feet out uh, in a V. Turn one foot to the side, other foot stays facing toward the front. 
rising up, we're gonna come into a triangle pose. Hips square, shoulders square, arms out. Reach to the side, keeping that torso between two panes of glass. Let that hand fall where it's comfortable. Nice stretch here. Lift up with that top hand, switch the feet, re-square the shoulders and hips, reach to the side, let that hand fall. Big stretch here. Lift, walk the feet in a little to your second position, still really wide, wider than hips. Inhale, arms up, exhale, plie, inhale up, exhale. Let your heart rate slow, let your breathing slow one last time. And exhale. Gentlemen, take your bow. Ladies, take your curtsy. Thank you for joining bar class today. I'm glad you could make it. Thank you, Trina.